Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A man is serving food at a counter. B. People are standing in a queue at a bus stop. C. A man is preparing a presentation in an office. D. A woman is typing on a laptop. The correct answer is A. A man is serving food at a counter. Number 2. A. A man is painting a house. B. A woman is typing on a laptop in a bank. C. A group of students is studying. D. People are attending a wedding ceremony. The correct answer is B. A woman is typing on a laptop in a bank. Number 3. A. A group of people is attending a business meeting. B. Several people are jogging along the beach. C. Two people are sitting on a bench in a garden. D. A man is reading a book in a park. The correct answer is A. A group of people is attending a business meeting. Number 4. A. A woman is reading a book in a park. B. A group of tourists is taking pictures. C. A man is sitting on a bench with a typewriter. D. People are shopping at a market. The correct answer is C. A man is sitting on a bench with a typewriter. Number 5. A. A woman is shopping in a grocery store. B. A man is standing in a classroom, talking on the phone. C. People are playing a board game. D. Two people are walking along a pier. The correct answer is B. A man is standing in a classroom talking on the phone. Number 6. A. A group of people is attending a cooking class. B. A chef is giving a presentation in a restaurant. C. Customers are waiting to be served at a restaurant. D. Two waiters are preparing dishes in a restaurant. The correct answer is D. Two waiters are preparing dishes in a restaurant. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Who will present the report? A. It was very informative. B. Yes, the report is ready. C. Mr. Johnson will. The correct answer is C. Mr. Johnson will. Number 2. Why did you leave early? A. No, I haven't. B. I had a medical appointment. C. Three miles away. The correct answer is B. I had a medical appointment. Number 3. When is the deadline for the application? A. By the end of this month. B. I submitted mine yesterday. C. No, not yet. The correct answer is A. By the end of this month. Number 4. Is the webinar free? A. Yes, it is. B. It's about marketing. C. No, it's for next week. The correct answer is A. Yes, it is. Number 5. How was the presentation? A. He was speaking softly. B. Next week. C. The slides were clear. The correct answer is C. The slides were clear. Number 6. Who is presenting the project? A. Mr. Lee is. B. 
next Monday. C. Is it mandatory? The correct answer is A. Mr. Lee is. Number 7. Who will give the presentation? A. The presentation was very informative. B. Mr. Lee will handle it. C. It's scheduled for 2 p.m. The correct answer is B. Mr. Lee will handle it. Number 8. Where should we meet for lunch? A. Let's go to the new Italian place. B. I'm free after 12. C. I haven't eaten yet. The correct answer is A. Let's go to the new Italian place. Number 9. Why was the project delayed? A. Due to unexpected technical issues. B. It's at 2 p.m. C. Yes, it was. The correct answer is A. Due to unexpected technical issues. Number 10. Have you completed the survey? A. I will do it soon. B. Yes, I did it this morning. C. It was very interesting. The correct answer is B. Yes, I did it this morning. Number 11. Is this your first visit to our company? A. No, I work here. B. I'll go next week. C. Yes, it is. The correct answer is C. Yes, it is. Number 12. When will you submit your proposal? A. Yes, it's almost done. B. I'm working on it now. C. By tomorrow morning. The correct answer is C. By tomorrow morning. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. I need to submit my travel expenses. Did you fill out all the forms? Not yet. Make sure to submit them by Friday. By when does the man need to submit the travel expenses? A. By Friday. B. By Wednesday. C. By Monday. The correct answer is A. By Friday. Number 2. Can you review the quarterly report before the presentation this Friday? Sure, I'll look over it tonight. Thanks. The presentation is scheduled for 9 a.m. No problem. I'll be ready by then. When will the presentation be held? A. This Friday. B. Tonight. C. 9 a.m. The correct answer is C. 9 a.m. Number 3. I need to cancel my appointment for Friday afternoon. No problem. When would you like to reschedule? Can we make it Monday morning instead? Sure, I'll update the calendar. When was the original appointment? A. Wednesday morning. B. Monday morning. C. Friday afternoon. The correct answer is C. Friday afternoon. Number 4. I'm thinking about attending the industry conference next month. That sounds like a great idea. Which sessions are you interested in? Mostly the marketing and innovation tracks. You should definitely sign up. What tracks is the woman interested in? A. Sales and operation. B. Marketing and innovation. C. Finance and HR. The correct answer is B. Marketing and innovation. Number 5. Have you completed the report for the quarterly meeting? I'll have it ready by the end of the day. Make sure to include the new sales figures. I will. I'll add those right after lunch. When will the report be ready? A. By the end of the day. B. Tomorrow. C. Immediately. The correct answer is A. By the end of the day. Number 6. 
Are you ready for our presentation to the board? Almost. I need another hour. We present at 4 p.m. sharp. I'll be ready by then. No worries. What time is the presentation? A. At 2 p.m. B. At 4 p.m. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. At 4 p.m. Number 7. Are you coming to the team lunch tomorrow? Yes, I've already made a reservation for 12.30 p.m. Great, I'll see you there. Looking forward to it. What time is the team lunch? A. 12 p.m. B. 12.30 p.m. C. 1 p.m. The correct answer is B. 12.30 p.m. Number 8. Our flight for the business trip is at 10 a.m. tomorrow. Should we meet at the airport at 8 a.m. to check in? Yes, that should give us plenty of time. I'll make sure to be there by 8. What time is the flight? A. At 8 a.m. B. At 10 a.m. C. At 11 a.m. The correct answer is B. At 10 a.m. Number 9. Can you send me the minutes from the team meeting? Sure, I'll email them to you in a few minutes. Thanks, I need to review them before my presentation. No problem, I'm on it. Why does the man need the meeting minutes? A. For a report. B. For a presentation. C. For a review. The correct answer is... B. For a presentation. Number 10. Are we still meeting with the marketing team this afternoon? Actually, the meeting has been moved to tomorrow morning. Thanks for the update. I'll adjust my schedule accordingly. No problem. When will the meeting with the marketing team take place? A. Tomorrow afternoon. B. This afternoon. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is... C. Tomorrow morning. Number 11. Can we reschedule our one-on-one -on -one meeting to Thursday? I have back-to-back -back meetings that day. How about Friday morning instead? Friday morning works for me. Let's do 9 a.m.? 9 a.m. is perfect. I'll send a revised calendar invite. When will the rescheduled meeting take place? A. Thursday afternoon. B. Monday morning. C. Friday morning. The correct answer is C. Friday morning. Number 12. Can I schedule my annual leave for the last week of August? I'll need to check the team calendar first. Please let me know as soon as possible. I'll do that by the end of today. When does the woman want to take leave? A. First week of September. B. Middle of August. C. Last week of August. The correct answer is C. Last week of August. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Don't miss our summer sale event. All items in store are up to 50% off until the end of the month. This is the perfect time to grab summer clothing, accessories, and more at unbeatable prices. Visit us now for the best deals. How long will the summer sale event last? A. Until the weekend. B. One week only. C. Until the end of the month. The correct answer is C. Until the end of the month. Number 2. Welcome to the annual book fair. Explore a vast selection of books from various genres and meet your favorite authors. Many authors will be signing books at designated times, so check the schedule at the entrance. The fair runs from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., and there's something for everyone. When does the book fair end? A. 6 p.m. B. 5 p.m. C. 4 p.m. The correct answer is... C. 6 p.m. Number 3. Join us this Sunday for our annual charity run starting at 9 a.m. in Central Park. 
All proceeds will go towards local community projects. Participants need to register online by Saturday to receive a race bib and timing chip. When is the charity run taking place? A. Next Sunday at 10 a.m. B. This Saturday at 8 a.m. C. This Sunday at 9 a.m. The correct answer is B. This Sunday at 9 a.m. Number 4. Attention shoppers. Our store is having a major sale this weekend with discounts up to 50% off. Don't miss out on great deals across all departments, including electronics, clothing, and groceries. Remember to check out our clearance section for even more savings. Happy shopping! What percentage of discounts is being offered during the sale? A. 10%. B. Up to 50%. C. 30%. The correct answer is C. Up to 50%. Number 5. Attention all passengers. The train to Springfield is now boarding at Platform 3. Please have your tickets ready for inspection and ensure all luggage is securely stored. The train will depart in 15 minutes. Thank you for choosing our service. Which platform is the train to Springfield boarding at? A. Platform 3. B. Platform 1. C. Platform 2. The correct answer is A. Platform 3. Number 6. Attention all passengers. Due to maintenance work, the main train line will be closed this weekend. Substitute bus services will be available from the station. Please plan your travel accordingly and allow extra time for your journey. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. Why will the main train line be closed? A. Maintenance work. B. Heavy rain. C. Holiday celebrations. The correct answer is A. Maintenance work. Number 7. Welcome to the Green Energy Expo. This event showcases the latest in renewable energy technologies, including solar, wind, and geothermal power. Speak with industry experts, attend informative workshops, and discover how you can contribute to a sustainable future. What types of energy are featured at the Expo? A. Solar, wind, and geothermal. B. Hydroelectric only. C. Nuclear and fossil fuels. The correct answer is A. Solar, wind, and geothermal. Number 8. Greetings. This is a reminder that the annual Neighborhood Cleanup Day is scheduled for the first Saturday of next month. We invite all community members to participate and help us keep our neighborhood clean and green. Garbage bags and gloves will be provided at the main park. When is the Neighborhood Cleanup Day scheduled? A. Every Sunday. B. First Saturday of next month. C. Last Saturday of this month. The correct answer is A. First Saturday of next month. Number 9. Attention residents. The local council will be holding a public meeting this Friday to discuss the new park development plans. Your feedback and participation are valuable to us. Please mark your calendars and attend if you can. Together we can create a better community. What is the purpose of the public meeting this Friday? A. To announce new local businesses. B. To organize a community picnic. C. To discuss the new park development plans. The correct answer is C. To discuss the new park development plans. Number 10. Attention, all employees, the fire drill will take place tomorrow at 10 a.m. Please ensure you know your evacuation routes. Report to the designated assembly point once you exit the building. Safety wardens will be on hand to assist. What time is the fire drill? A. 9 a.m. B. 10 a.m. C. 11 a.m. The correct answer is A. 10 a.m. Number 11. Welcome to our training session on workplace ergonomics. Today we will go over proper posture, desk setup, and stretching exercises. 
These practices will help prevent injuries and improve productivity. Let's begin with the basics of posture. What is the first topic of the training session? A. Proper posture. B. Stretching exercises. C. Desk setup. The correct answer is A. Proper posture. Number 12. Ladies and gentlemen, we are delighted to announce the grand opening of our new community center. The facility includes a gym, library, and several meeting rooms available for local events. We hope this center will become a hub for community activities and foster a stronger connection among residents. What does the community center offer? A. A theater. B. A gym and library. C. A swimming pool. The correct answer is B. A gym and library. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, they succeeded. Solving the problem. A, in, B, to, C, on, D, at. The correct answer is A, in. Number two, she works. A multinational company. A, for, B, on, C, in, D, at. The correct answer is A, four. Number three, they. The new system when the power went out. A, tested. B, have tested. C, were testing. D, are testing. The correct answer is C, were testing. Number four, the results were disappointing than expected a most b more c two d as the correct answer is b more number five we finished the task time for the presentation a in b at c on d by The correct answer is A. In. Number six. They have been working. The project for three months. A. In. B. With. C. At. D. On. The correct answer is D. On. Number seven. The manager is not here today, but he. Tomorrow. A. Returns. B. Will return. C. Returned. D. Is returning. The correct answer is B. Will return. Number 8. The presentation was so long. Everyone became tired. A. So. B. Then. C. That. D. As. The correct answer is C. That. Number 9. He finished the report when I called him. A. Has. B. Had. C. Is. D. Was. The correct answer is B. Had. Number 10. They have been working here. Five years. A. Since, B, for, C, during, D, in. The correct answer is, B, for. Number 11. The manager insisted. 
holding the meeting on time. A. About. B. 2. C. On. D. In. The correct answer is C. On. Number 12. The manager insisted. Holding the meeting on time. A. 4. B. In. C. On. D. 2. The correct answer is C. On. Next up is Part 6. Reading, Text Completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. To whom it may concern, this letter is to recommend Mr. Brown for the position he has. 4. He has consistently demonstrated a high level of professionalism and skill. A. Applied. B. Application. C. Applying. D. Apply. The correct answer is A. Applied. Number 2. Dear students, classes will be on Wednesday due to a public holiday. Please adjust your schedules accordingly. A. Cancelled. B. Cancels. C. Canceling. D. Cancel. The correct answer is A. Cancelled. Number 3. Dear Mr. Johnson, if you have any questions about the new company policy, please do not hesitate to me. Best regards, Alice Thompson. A. Contacts. B. Contact. C. Contacted. D. Contacting. The correct answer is B. Contact. Number 4. The annual financial report is due next week. Please ensure all expense reports are by Friday. A. Submit. B. Submitting. C. Submitted. D. Submits. The correct answer is C. Submitted. Number 5. Please find attach the minutes of the last meeting for your review. Kindly let me know if any are needed. A. Corrections. B. Correcting. C. Correct. D. Correctly. The correct answer is A. Corrections. Number 6. Dear Mr. Lee, your request for a refund has been Please allow 5-7 business days for the transaction to be processed. Best regards, customer service. A. Approving. B. Approved. C. Approves. D. Approve. The correct answer is B. Approved. And finally, Part 7, Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear team, please be informed that our weekly meeting has been rescheduled to Thursday at 3 p.m. due to scheduling conflicts. Kindly make the necessary adjustments to your calendars. Apologies for any inconvenience caused. Regards, HR Department. What is the purpose of this email? A. To announce a new team member. B. To notify about a change in meeting schedule. C. To cancel the weekly meeting. The correct answer is B. To notify about a change in meeting schedule. Number 2. Dear workshop attendees, this is a reminder that the upcoming workshop on effective communication skills will be held on Friday, April 22nd, from 9 on talk a.m to 4 hung p.m. in room 305. Please bring your completed pre-assessment forms. We look forward to your participation. Best, the training team. What are participants required to bring? A. Completed pre-assessment forms. B. A laptop. C. Lunch. The correct answer is A. Completed pre-assessment forms. Number 3. Attention customers. 
Due to unforeseen circumstances, Flight 3432 to New York has been delayed by two hours. The new departure time is now scheduled for 6.45 p.m. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause, and thank you for your patience. Why was this announcement made? A. To announce a flight cancellation. B. To inform about a flight delay. C. To offer a new flight. The correct answer is B. To inform about a flight delay. Number 4. We are excited to announce the launch of our latest product, the Smart X Watch. It offers advanced features such as health monitoring, GPS tracking, and seamless smartphone integration. The Smart X Watch will be available in stores and online starting next Monday. What is being launched? A. A new product, the Smart X Watch. B. A health program. C. An online store. The correct answer is A. A new product, the Smart X Watch. Number 5. Dear customers, starting next Monday, our store hours will be extended to better serve you. The new hours will be from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m., seven days a week. We hope to see you in our store soon. Regards, Store Manager. What change is being announced? A. Store closure. B. Extended store hours. C. Reduction in store hours. The correct answer is B. Extended store hours. Number 6. Notice, the parking lot will be resurfaced on Monday and Tuesday between 8 a.m. and 6 p.m. Please park your vehicles in the overflow lot during these hours. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause maintenance department. Where should vehicles be parked during the resurfacing work? A. In the main lot. B. On the street. C. In the overflow lot. The correct answer is C. In the overflow lot. Number 7. Ladies and gentlemen, we are hosting a charity auction on Saturday, July 15th at the Grand Ballroom to support local schools. Your participation and generous contributions can make a significant impact. Join us for an evening of entertainment and philanthropy. Warm regards, event organizers. What is the main event mentioned in the announcement? A. A product launch. B. A business conference. C. A charity auction. The correct answer is C. A team building workshop. Number 8. We are excited to announce the launch of our new customer loyalty program. Members will earn points for every purchase, which can be redeemed for discounts on future orders. Sign up today to start earning rewards and enjoy exclusive member benefits. What is the main feature of the new program? A. Earning points for purchases. B. Extended return policy. C. Weekly newsletters. The correct answer is A. Earning points for purchases. Number 9. Dear valued customers, we want to inform you of the updated customer service hours effective from October 1st. Our new hours will be Monday to Friday, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. We appreciate your understanding and continued support. Best regards, customer service team. What is changing according to the notice? A. The location of the service center. B. The customer service hours. C. The product return policy. The correct answer is B. The customer service hours. Number 10. Dear team, we are pleased to announce that our annual team building retreat will take place from October 10th to 12th. All employees are encouraged to join for an opportunity to enhance teamwork and collaboration. More details will follow soon. What is the event being announced? A. Office renovation. B. Annual team building retreat. C. Quarterly business meeting. The correct answer is B. Annual team building retreat.
Number 11. Our company is implementing a new project management system starting next month. This change aims to improve efficiency and communication within the team. Training sessions will be provided, and attendance is mandatory for all project managers and team leads. We appreciate your cooperation in making this transition successful. What is the main purpose of this announcement? A. To schedule a company outing. B. To announce a new product launch. C. To announce a new project management system. The correct answer is C. To announce a new project management system. Number 12. Our annual charity run will take place on Sunday, May 22nd at Riverside Park. This year, we are raising funds to support local education initiatives. Registration starts at 7 a.m. and the run begins at 8 a.m. We hope to see many participants. Regards, Event Committee. What is the purpose of this event? A. To support local education initiatives. B. To celebrate a holiday. C. To promote a new product. The correct answer is A. To support healthcare causes. Number 13. Dear team, congratulations on achieving record sales this quarter. Your hard work and dedication have truly paid off. To celebrate this success, we will be hosting a team lunch next Friday at noon in the break room. What is the main idea of this email? A. Introducing new products. B. Celebrating record sales. C. Offering a training session. The correct answer is B. Announcing layoffs. Number 14. Dear Parents. This is a reminder that the school will be hosting a parent teacher conference next Wednesday. Please schedule your appointment with your child's teacher by this Friday. We look forward to discussing your child's progress. Best regards, school administration. What action is requested from the parents? A. Attend a school event. B. Enroll their child in a program. C. Schedule a parent-teacher conference. The correct answer is C. Schedule a parent-teacher conference. Number 15. Hello team. We are implementing a new project management tool starting July 1st. Training sessions will be held next week, and attendance is required. This tool will streamline our workflow and improve productivity. Best. Project Management Office. What change is being communicated? A. Holiday plans. B. Performance reviews. C. Introduction of a new project management tool. The correct answer is C. Introduction of a new project management tool. Number 16. Dear attendees, due to unforeseen circumstances, the business seminar originally scheduled for January 5th will now take place on January 12th at the same venue. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and look forward to your participation on the new date. Thank you for your understanding, Event Coordination Team. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To announce a new venue. B. To cancel an event. C. To reschedule a seminar. The correct answer is C. To reschedule a seminar. Number 17. Notice. The elevator in Building B will be undergoing repairs from Tuesday, October 5th to Friday, October 8th. During this period, please use the stairs or the elevator in Building A. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and appreciate your understanding. What is the announcement about? A. Elevator repairs in Building B. B. A fire drill in Building B. C. A new parking policy. The correct answer is A. Elevator repairs in Building B. Number 18. Starting from next month, we will implement a new performance review system to improve employee feedback and development. The new system will include quarterly reviews, 
self-assessments, and 360-degree feedback from peers. Detailed guidelines will be shared via email. What is the new system about? A. Performance review. B. Employee benefits. C. New hiring process. The correct answer is A. Performance review.